Today we have prepared a small presentation of the new smartphone Oculet Key 6. First of all, I would like to talk about the design, features, performance and the camera test. The first impression when I opened this little box was encouraging round edged 6.0 inches full high definition 1080 by 2160 pixels huge display dual cameras in both sides Face ID unlock 6 gigs of RAM and 64 gigs of ROM For better or for worse this phone is very heavy thanks to battery 6300 mAh with quick charge 3.0 I would say this phone will suit people for those who often on the way so they don't have to carry power bank or was stuck next to the power outlets also with such performance of this phone games get more fun and enjoyable if you are a gamer this phone can be your budget and good choice Oculet Key 6 6 gigs of RAM and 64 gigs of memory storage However, if it's not enough, you can also insert a TV card up to 128GB. GPU ARM Mali G71 MP2 and CPU MT6763 octa-core 2.0 GHz. This device with massive battery can also be used for charge other phones in a rush moment. For that, you need to use USB host adapter and any micro USB cable to charge other devices. Oculet K6 has built in with four cameras, dual rear camera with the resolution 21 and 8 megapixels, dual front cameras 13 with 8 megapixels. Let me just show you the pictures are taken on this device. First of all, all regular pictures. Even with the low light condition, here we can see the background details, it's clear and if we zoom it, it's still relatively sharp, with sharp lines and no strong grain. From this picture, I use a blur effect and change the point level of focus. The blur effect of this picture, it's not very smooth, but in focus, the sharpness are acceptable. We got a cloud rainy day today, I'm sure, under sunny condition, this picture should have a good performance as well. This photo, I photographed it in mono setting. And it came out with beautiful texture, median filter with good performance in a gray. There are another feature which is very good, face ID unlock. It is convenient and safe, but you can always select other unlocking methods, such as fingerprint in a background or password depends on your choice. I prefer to use fingerprint pass, it's faster. That's all for today, we hope this video will help you to decide will you purchase this smartphone or not, we would like to know, please leave a comment and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching and have a good day.